Hey guys, what's up? Daniel here with DarkEdits.com. Today we're taking a look at the new internet browser on Google Glass. Now this was added today in the new um, update for Glass, which changes a little bit of the interface, but more importantly adds this web browsing capability. Uh, so we can go like we can go ahead and say Google Apple.com and and wow okay why would it do that okay it still got that so you don't have to search apple.com you can browse a restaurant anything and then it'll give you the option you tap on it it'll give you the option to go to the original web page or the source uh, so we can double tap on here it'll take us to view website and it'll load the whole page as it would on your mobile device um, some pages will load as mobile versions some will not um, it depends on the web page um, but Apple's page is like this. So we can hold two fingers on the side of the touchpad and then we can move our head around and it will basically just let us, you know, view the whole page, certain parts that we need, etc. We can also scroll down and up by just dragging one finger across the touchpad. And then we can use two fingers back and forth to zoom in and zoom out. So we can go ahead and zoom in on the MacBook Pro over, or the Mac Pro. Um, just in case I can't read something that well from far away, now I can just read it perfectly. Um, and then I can also go ahead and uh, as you can see right there, that's the cursor, that circle in the middle. So that's where I guide the I guide the cursor there, and then I double tap to select the link. Um, so it's very intuitive and uh, actually pretty neat. Um, and right now it does take a while. I don't know why it's, there's a little bit of lag and you won't see it perfectly over here. It's much faster on glass though when it, it's not screen casting. And if you are wondering, this is a touchpad running CM10. Um, and I, I did it because I just had to show you guys this. That was the only way I could do it. I don't have an Android device on me right now. Um, so there we go. So you can see the whole page, very fluid, or at least on glass it is. And you can see everything very clear. We can zoom into the text right here so that I can read the text. Um, so right there, that's perfect. And I can just go boom, 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 look around, look around, and just read that whole paragraph or whatever I need to quickly. Um, now, is it, it also works on YouTube. You can go on youtube.com and watch videos and stuff, but I can't show you guys this because it just doesn't work. Um, the page loads and the video, um, well, the video page loads, but the video itself does not load and then it just crashes um, because I guess it's just too much for the app and stuff to handle. Um, but that's pretty much it. You can just do that on Yelp pages, anything you want, Empire right here. I did that earlier when I was trying this video. Um, that Wikipedia page, we can just view the whole Wikipedia article and read it and search for the parts that you need. Um, but it's pretty straightforward, very cool update, and I'm really looking forward to see what Google has in store in the future. Um, but this update just proves that um, by the time that this comes out next year, it'll have a lot more things. Right now they're still adding some basic things that people would want. Um, obviously this browser isn't the most practical thing out there. It's be You're better off using your phone but in some emergencies or some things that you might need real quick, you can't pull out your phone and you need a little tidbits of information or just not this little tidbit, but you need a little bit more than this. Um, I guess it's just good to know that you can visit the whole page right from your eye. Um, but yeah, that is pretty much it. That was a mouthful. Make sure to subscribe if you want to watch more glass videos in the future. Um, check out the page. If you need to contact me, go ahead and contact me in the contact me page on the website. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Goodbye.